Actress and comedian Amy Schumer is pregnant with her first child, but that excitement is being overshadowed by a complication doctors say is 10 times worse than morning sickness. And it's something that doctors say you at home cannot take care of. The doctor that I spoke to at Ohio Health says it's very, very serious because it takes away a woman's ability to tolerate anything that she ingests, no food, no water. They just can't get through the day. They have light sensitivity, headaches sometimes. Their actual electrolytes will get out of balance and cause arrhythmias if it gets severe. Actress and comedian Amy Schumer is bedridden with this severe form of morning sickness, even canceling her upcoming shows in Texas. She posted this picture and told her Twitter followers, the baby is fine, she's fine, quote, but everyone who says the second trimester is better is not telling the full story. I, I, don't know. <laughs> I popped in at Ohio Health to ask Dr. Stu Jones what causes it. If you're carrying twins, the, 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 you know, what is the mechanism behind epiremesis and nausea? We think it's the beta HCG, the hormone hormone level that's creating it and uh, for some women it just creates more of an issue than others and that's why those hormones will peak at around 11 to 12 weeks. Dr. Jones says there are a lot of myths and misconceptions. It affects any mother to be anywhere during those child rearing years that's 19 to 40 and it doesn't somehow vanish after the first trimester. It can stick around the length of pregnancy and like Duchess Kate Middleton hypermyesis can strike each time a woman is pregnant. Dr. Jones says the key here is to pay attention to your body and know when it's time to tell your doctor that something serious is happening to your body and it's not just the baby growing inside. One thing, if you go through a couple days of not being able to keep food down or fluids down, you want to call your doctor. We don't want to get behind on this because it's harder to catch up. Dr. Jones says hypermyesis can be treated. First, he says you have to just let it go that you're just supposed to be feeling like this because it just comes with pregnancy. No, it does not. With IV and lots of bland foods, he says, you'll be just fine and you'll forget all about it the first time you lay eyes on that baby.